Welcome back to EA Sports, continuing coverage of the playoffs. I'm James Cebulski. Game five set to go between these two teams that have put on a fight so far. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Takes the pass on the left wing. Drives to the page. Scores. Mitch. Well, this is a hard-working goal as well, James. you got to fight for that inner area of the ice, you know, and when you're in that low-slot area, it ain't easy to get to that spot. And then when that puck is on your stick, you know that you're going to come into some heavy traffic. Great job to find the back of the net. The Leafs quickly send a message that home sweet home is overrated, Cheryl. Uh, it is in this case, and what a quick start for the away team. This is exactly what they wanted to do. They're up one with under a minute into the game, and wow, now their home team is chasing the game. A short pass to Pasternak. Let's it go to the slot. Big time save by Samsonov. And he gives it over to Marner. And that's intercepted by Pasternak. Taken by Marchand. And now he tries to get it across to Pasternak. Matthews looks around. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. And that pass is redirected. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. And it's a quick pass to Brody. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Grizzlick's got it across the line. Levels him with the hit. Great lead in the offense and so by the Russ. Oh, and he just puts it wide on the net. Sometimes when you have the puck on your stick in a prime time scoring area, it's not about threading the needle. And when you try and thread it, sometimes you miss. And that's what happened there. time left in this period. The Leafs have taken a 1-0 lead. And they win the draw on their own end. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Puck scooped up by Heinen. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Toronto's got a hold of the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. Picked up by Yarncro. The Leafs going to work on offense. Takes a lap but still hangs on. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Toronto's got it, and they're on the attack. The Bruins have it from their own end. And that's deflected off someone in front. Picked up along the boards by Shattenkirk. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Boston's on the attack. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Here we go, on man rush. And that's offside, stopping the play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Leafs lead it 1-0. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Leafs carry it along the wall. Hard blast. Can't get it to go. Back at the point, he's set it up. Tries to get it out of harm's way. Change is coming up front as they send the puck in. Moves it quickly over to Riley. Icing is the call. We'll get a face up at the other end. Marshawn's team is trailing, and he's out there looking to make a difference for them, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability to get things going offensively. Picked up along the wall by Shattenkirk. 
And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll be forced to tag up. The Bruins will play it from the defensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Marshall. He's got a stop! Stopped on the breakaway! What a save he made there! Well, I loved how he challenged the shooter on this, James. He didn't sit back in his net. He came right out to the top of the paint and said, if you're going to beat me, you got to find room. And he caught him when he wasn't looking. What a hit! In order to dictate the tempo of the game right at the onset of it, you want to make your opponent think and hear you coming, and that's what he does with that first hit. And he can't find the net. Ron, I like everything about this play until the finish, James. It's all about creating. That's exactly what happens. And then the puck is looking a little fine as it makes its way towards the net, and it misses. Boston's had the scoring opportunities, but they still find themselves behind in the first. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. The Bruins take it along the wall. Moves it to the middle. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. The Leafs looking against the half wall. Answer the call there. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Sack has won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Pass right in front. Big save. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. Toronto's won the draw. From the slot, wrist shot, and gets a piece of it with the tracker. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. The Bruins have been picking off passes left, right, and center. You know the coach is gonna like this, but it has to transition to offense because this game's awfully close. Slides it over with pace to Bertuzzi. The Bruins look to start the transition game. And he slides it quickly to Frederick. Centering feed. He scores! What a play! This is exactly why you send bodies to the front of the net, James. You want to create a screen, and the goaltender drops into the butterfly position as a default and is battling to find the puck. Can't find it and beats him clean. And off the draw, they take the puck. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Sends it over to Riley. Along the half wall with the puck. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Nine minutes, 40 seconds. Past the halfway mark of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Looking to break out. Moves it to Riley. And that pass attempt is deflected. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Sends a pass over. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, now they're in front, James, so they'll have some energy. You know that their first three strides will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. I love the confidence he had to take this shot, James, but it's because his head was up. He recognized he had the lane through the traffic jam and beat the goaltender. The Leafs take the one goal lead here in the first. Uh, and if I'm the coach, I'm telling them to keep going, be aggressive, stay on the puck, especially after you score a goal head goal. He got them back on their heels. He got to attack. Tavares wins the draw at center. A centering chance! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Boston's got the 
puck along the wall. Fires it into the offensive zone. Takes the feed. Here they come on the attack. Can't get it to go. The Bruins gain possession. Here they come up along the wing. Nice poke check. Grabbed along the board by Yarko. Lilgren's got it in the defensive end. And they'll dump it in. Boston's got the puck along the boards. With some open space at center. Takes the knot, but he's still got the puck. The Bruins played along the boards. Quick feed to Pasternak. Toronto's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Pinned up along the boards. Play whistle dead offside the call. Here in the back half of this period, Toronto's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. That's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. The Bruins gain possession in their own end. Steps into the offensive end. Scooped up along the wall by Domi. Refs arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Well, that's certainly not going to help the team. I mean, they're losing by one. They got to find a way to get some momentum to get on the board. Now they find themselves killing a penalty. Matthews dekes his way past the opposition and finishes with a quick shot to light the lamp. His shock and awe zone ability is really impressive to watch unfold. Pasternak's got that snipe zone ability. His shots are so accurate when the puck is flat and ready for him. Those are two players I'm going to watch closely to see if one of them could be a difference maker for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Boston's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Bertuzzi's got the puck in his own zone. Here's a chance! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. He's got those magic mitts, James, and he also has patience. And when those two factors are combined, they create space. And when he gets that space, he attacks the net. This time, though, the goaltender shuts him down. Taken along the wall by Bertuzzi. Trying to exit the defensive zone. They get it done. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Oh, right off the cage. I don't think he had time to get his head out of the way, and that one hits his mask. You got to give it to the quality of mask nowadays. If that happened a few years ago, ooh, that would hurt even more. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Here in the late going to the frame, the Leafs are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Lil Prince loving the puck. Boston's got possession at center. Here's a short pass to Pasternak. Attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Puts it on net, and that caroms off a body in the lane. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. We got a whistle offside the call. Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. Toronto's won the draw. Moves the puck. Takes a shot, and the traffic neutralizes that threat. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Even though goaltenders get set in their butterfly positioning, they still have to be agile and be able to move across their crease. Right there, that's evidence of it, and with that beautiful save. Puck battle along the boards. Boston's got a hold of the puck now. Takes a shot. Oh, look at this. They are really starting to apply the pressure now. Here they come on the attack. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. 
The Bruins take it along the wall. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that's stuff by Sam Soto. Lopez takes a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. Just the puck away. Time to get a clean sheet of ice here as period number one comes to an end. As you heard the horn sound, we'll be back with much, much more as this is going to be a fun one tonight. The Bruins will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. A power play then can even the score here, James. Oh, well, there's going to be a call on that one, James. Toss up the puck after that hit. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Well, the bench doesn't like this call, James. It's untimely to say the least with that one goal lead. Now, the PK unit, they got to get out there and they got to do a job. Boston's got a five on three, and the clock's their BFF here. Five on three, you know your opponent has big bodies with long sticks in the middle. Scores! And so they convert on the power play. Well, they drew the penalty because they were competing and they were urgent on the puck, James, and then the same approach came on the power play where they knew how to hound it and retrieve it, and guess what? They're rewarded for their efforts. Well, power play face-offs in the Ozone. This is exactly what you love. Coaches love to draw it up, and you work on it in practice. This was executed perfectly. The Bruins have made this a whole new game in period number two. The difference in the close game is often the details, James, and this is a group that have worked hard. They've had good habits, and they find themselves tied. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Saka has got it in the offensive zone. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Moose it quickly over to McAvoy. Oh, puts it wide, and oh, no, he'll want that one back. Well, you can see the frustration right there. I think there was a sense of urgency, but he had more time than he thought. The Leafs get a hold of the puck under man. Sent into the offensive zone. Knocked away in the offensive zone. From center, they get into the attacking area. And he's ridden off the puck. Picked up along the boards by Zaka. Great glove save by Samsonov. Zaka has been lighting the lamp with this point streak, playing so confident. He knows where he is on the ice, and it just seems that every time it makes its way towards the net, the puck's going in. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. They win the draw and go on the attack. Moves it to McAvoy. Nothing doing. What the stop. Marner's penalty is almost expired. Oh, this looks dangerous. And that rush is broken up with a great defensive effort there. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. From behind the net. Quick pass to Kiki. No room for that one to get through. Just line. Real difficult to get to the middle of the ice. Often you pay the price, and he's got a golden opportunity from the slot area and just misses. Domi's got the puck along the wing. Here's the pass. The Leafs have it behind the cage. Standing tall with the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's all tied up. Boston's won the draw. And he takes the pass. Slides the puck over. Puts it on net. Oh, gets a proper on that one as he just got enough of it. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Fires it on net. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off.
Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. And off the draw, they win possession. Here he is, takes the shot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. Well, he's showing great mobility here as he drops into the butterfly and moves across his crease with ease to make the save. Lubushkin's been whacked on the player. The official's arm is up in the air. Here comes the call from the official. Lauko's getting called for slashing. is not a number that you see typically. So they gotta find a way to just stay confident, trust the process and their skill sets. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. The Bruins gain possession of the defensive zone. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Looks to get the puck over to Domi. The Leafs played along the wing. Here's a shot. Oh, he got pummeled by Sweeman. Well, players should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Slick feed. Shot! And he makes the save. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a faceoff? Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to Bertuzzi. Blocked in traffic. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Marner's distribution of the puck makes him an asset to his team, guys. He has that third eye zone ability, which means he can find his teammates with passes that are hard to complete. But if you get open, he'll put it on your stick. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Clarko standing up, ready to go. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Chalked out up as a win for the penalty kill here as the penalty expires, both teams get back to even strength. Specialty teams are so huge in any game, James, especially when it's tied. You don't want to fall behind and have discipline really be a factor in the game. And that goes up the post and out. Boston's been on the wrong side of the hockey gods tonight, James. How many have they shot off the post? Laying the body. Boston's gained possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Comes up with a stop. I love the shiftiness to his game. He reads the pace of play, and he can manipulate his own speed. It's not always 100 miles an hour, but he gets the job done. And this time, he gets the shot off, but the goaltender just makes a nice save. And that goes off a player. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Takes it and looks ahead. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Matthews. Tavares carries the puck in his own zone. Toronto's got it along the wall. Centering feed! It's that shot block! Puts it just wide of the net. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Boston's taking possession in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Moves it to the middle! And he denies that great opportunity there. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Sends it in on the attack. Battle along the wall. And now he moves it quickly to DeBrusque. Gains the zone along the right wall. Here's a pass in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Oh, save the what a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. 
such an impressive save, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position. It's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out battling and out willing everyone around you. Well past the midway mark of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Toronto's got the puck. Reeves brings it in. Quick pass across to Brody. What a great read breaking up the pass. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Samsonov's last save was so impressive, James. Really a last-ditch effort to find the puck. When you out-battle, when you out-will your opponent, everyone around you gets energized. Just look at the bench. Everyone is elevated because of that save. Boston's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a short pass to Benoit. Picked up along the wall by Reeves. Receives the pass. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. And a great heads-up defensive play here. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Handles the pass. Here's a pass in front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. Defensive hit some play to pick it off. Boston's got the puck against the half wall. Denies him! Samsonov's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. Centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. The Leafs win the defensive zone faceoff. Off a stick. Grabbed along the board by Loco. Moves it quickly over to Labushkin. The Leafs gain the zone. The Bruins have it behind the cage. Gets the puck over to Carlo. Oh, look at this chance. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Wax it into the offensive zone. And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Carlos gonna play it against the half wall. He was locked in there. Riley stick handling in his own zone. And it's a quick pass to Bertuzzi. With possession along the wall. Beautiful read of the defensive end by Pasternak. Moves it to Marshall. one-timer off quickly, James, because he didn't have much time and space in that net front area. You know that they're going to close quickly on you when you find that that puck comes across. Boston's finally broken through and has the lead now late in period number two. Well, it's been a hard-fought battle, and they put themselves in a great position here at the end of the second. Now, if they can just ride it out, get to the intermission, and start the third with a bang. The Leafs get a hold of it. Toronto's got the puck against the boards. Wotherspoon's taking it from his own end. Slides it over to Van Rienstein. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. And he gets in front of that. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Loses his balance on the play. And he takes the feed. And that's denied by Sensenov. Pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. In the final moments of this period, Boston's been the better looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one goal lead. Toronto's going to start with the puck in their own end. Boston's got to be feeling good about their game here as we head towards the intermission. 
already up by two now, late in period number two. Well, let's face it, it's been a hard-fought battle, but that last goal, I mean, it puts him in a great spot heading into the intermission. they got to find a way to elevate off of it and keep the foot on the gas. The Leafs have it now. Handles the pass at center. They put the puck into the offensive end. Quick feed to Matthews. Gains the zone through center. Moves the puck along the half wall. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. is in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square of the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Oh, he sticks into the line of fire and blocks that. Hopeless got it against the boards. Player is whistled dead as the puck goes up and over. The Bruins have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. Coyles won the draw here in the offensive zone. And he takes the dish. Poked away at center by McAvoy. Tried to get 2-2 with it and loses possession. Pasternak's got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one and the puck dies on his stick. Carlos got it along the wing. Shot! That's blocked by Sam Soto. Getting into the later stages of this period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Gets the puck in deep. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. And he slides it quickly to Saka. Here's a shot. Period. Well, there you go. Two periods down, one more to go, at least for now, right? Third period just around the corner. to hang on. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Leafs still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Offense is on face-off, and he wins the draw. Comes up with the block. Absolutely fearless. And he slides it quickly to McAvoy. Handles it along the blue line. The Leafs have it now. loose in the neutral zone. And he takes the feed. Pasternak's got the puck. Finds some space in the corner. Here's a short pass to McAvoy. Gets a piece of it to make the save. 
Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Look at this! Dishes it off! And that rush comes to an end as they can't make the play. Dumps it in. Handles the puck. And he sends it across to Van Riemsdyk. Takes the pass. Takes the feed. Shot! Makes the glove stop! By slashing the leather on this save, the shooter's in a great A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. The Bruins have been bringing the fire offensively tonight, and they lead it early in this third. Geekies won the draw there on the attack. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Here's a shot. And it's stopped by the glove. Nice play there. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Slides it on over to Carlo. Boston's got it in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Carlo. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And that's poked away by Lilgren. Into the offensive end right up the middle. Slides the puck down low. Moves it to Yarncroft. And that takes scores! And that's his first goal of the postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed too, James. You get to the playoffs, you want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to use the snapshot and beats the goaltender. Lots of time left in this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Slides the puck down low. Sends the pass over. Way too much congestion blocks that. Quick pass to Yonko. Battling for it along the boards. Boston's got possession of the puck. Angles it over to Heinen. On the attack along the boards. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Scooped up along the wall by Matthews. Oh, they telegraphed the pass, and he picks it off. Blocked in front. And a poke check knocks the puck away. The Bruins take it across the blue line. The Leafs have it from their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Corrado's got the puck against the wall. Takes a shot and makes a save. No, oh, he's one of the best in the game in turn. Oh, a save on the play! Samsonov's got it, and the officials blow the play dead. Well, and this is a smart play. He's been dialed in all night and recognizes that he doesn't want his team to make any mistakes. The safe play sometimes is to hold on. Boston's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Turned aside with the glove by Samsonov. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We've got a tie game. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. And comes up empty. He really bared down on his stick on that one. He got the velocity behind it, but it was nowhere near the net. Quick feed to Kent. Fantastic save. That knocks it off the puck. The Bruins will play it in their own end. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Moves it to Domi. The Leafs are across the line and into the offensive end. Great the save! And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Boston's got the win off that draw. Sends a pass over. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Go, 
And they win that neutral zone draw. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Well, he's got such a slick set of hands. He's trying to manipulate his opponent one by one, but he tries one too many, James, and he loses the puck. Now a quick pass to Krizlik. And there's another stop. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Jomi's won the draw here in their own zone. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. Takes the feed. McAvoy's moving the puck through his own zone. Dropped him in the open ice. Great defensive effort with the stick. Moves the puck. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. And he takes the pass. Takes a shot. Oh, what a club save there. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's all tied up. The Bruins win the draw. Van Riemsdyk's got it through center. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Tavares works the puck in his own zone. Toronto's on the attack. Club save. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the face-off. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Poked away in the neutral zone by Brody. And now he moves it quickly to Zaka. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. And sends it just out of reach. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. Toronto's moving it along the wing. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Oh, what a hit against the boards! Executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't maneuver. He's got nowhere to go. He's lined up, and then he's taken down. Tavares gains the zone. The Leafs ready to go on the attack. Denied that one. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Carlo. Handles the pass from the right wing. Taken by Carlo. And loses possession after a solid hit. Here they come on the rush. Johnson to the puck and he loses control. Into the offensive end now. Takes a shot. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. Toronto's got possession here in their own end. And it's a quick pass to Marner. Boston's got the puck along the boards. And here's the pass to Kiki. Here they come on the attack. Pass save, and he made it look easy. Great job there. And that's blocked in traffic. Chance in front. A critical draw here. The Leafs win it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck over. Off the crossbar! Malcolm has been effective getting to the right places at the right time, but it hits the post again, James. He cannot get discouraged. We're starting to see his frustration levels increase. Now over to Nylander. I've really enjoyed this game tonight, James. It's been tight, it's been fast-paced, defensively structured, and you never know which way it's gonna end. Gets the puck in deep. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Dumps it into the O-zone. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Reeves. Taken along the wall by McAvoy. Right in front with the shot! Made the stop on that play. This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot, and makes the save. Here's a short pass to Reeves. 
from along the boards, moves the puck ahead. Toronto's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Saka. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. Oh, he put it just wide as it hits the outside of the post. With a chance to go ahead and a huge opportunity right there, it's going to go off of the pipe and out. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Great puck check on the reach. Both sides digging into that puck along the wall. Slick feed. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Tries to feed it over to Kiki. Toronto's got a hold of the puck now. Receives the pass. Moves it to Kiki. He tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Great pass save. And now it's grabbed by Kiki. And somehow he hangs on. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. And we are still tied as we approach the final minute of the third. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Quick shot. Oh, and just gets a piece of it. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Pasternak. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Well, no one likes this call the third period when the game is tied, James. But you gotta stay focused and keep the task at hand. They've gotta kill this off. Toronto's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Boston's got it in the defensive zone. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And we'll get a face-off after the puck hops into the bench. Standing by with her thoughts on who had the edge tonight, it's our own Carlin B. Matthews has been buzzing out there, guys. He was able to get in on the scoring, and he's got the edge, in my opinion. How many bodies in the way? The Bruins carry it along the wall. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Nice play, short-handed as they get control of the puck. Look out! What a stick save at point blank range by Sweeman! Well, there you go. 60 minutes has been played out and still no winners. So we go to sudden death overtime. Lock in, folks, because this should be electric. Stay with us. Toronto's won the opening face-off, and their power play continues. The Leafs get a hold of the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Matthews. He's got the game on his stick. Not sure what happened there. Well, yeah, it looks like he was going left, then he was going left. Oh, well, that's going to be a call, James. That's definitely a penalty. And there's another penalty call against the home team. These fans are frustrated. Cheryl, I think these calls are legit. I just think that the fans are wondering, what about the other side here? Well, yeah, and they got to be expecting to get one soon here as it is one side. And it's so hard for a team to get into the game when there's no flow because you keep parading yourself to the box. The Leafs win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Boston's got the puck shorthanded. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Here we go, two on one. A pass. That's the save. Who thought it that stay out? And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Geeky's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Toronto's got it, and they're on the attack. Offensive zone faceoff. Pasternak's back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. Here's a shot. Turns him away. 
handles the pass. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. Toronto's looking to break out. Quick feed to Bertuzzi. Unable to reach that one. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Toronto's power play fails to capitalize an OT. Oh, that's tough, James. You have a chance to end the game. And instead, it's going back and forth. Really gave your opponent momentum. McAvoy's an effective stick checker in his own zone, guys. And that helps out his team's defensive game. We call that his stick-em-up zone ability. And it's what helps disrupt his opponent's attack. Here's a short pass to Martin. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Matthews wins the offensive zone face-off, and here we go. Made the save on the play. Picked up along the boards by Van Riemsdyk. And the stick breaks on the shot. And he takes the feed. Fires it! That one misses, and will play off. Well, you spend so much time trying to create scoring chances, and when you do, you got to find the back of the net at the very least. Hey, James. His reflexes on display tonight. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Coyles won the draw, and they'll look to set up. That's blocked. The Leafs are on the attack. Rocked him along the wall. Pasternak's got it in the defensive end. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Sweden. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Everyone has a role on a team, and this PK unit right now in overtime has to do a job if they want to remain in the game. once again send out their power play unit and what a golden opportunity here what a time in this game to have a power play opportunity in overtime the coaching staff has to settle their team down make sure they're ready to the stars they take it in overtime what an effort by this team out there tonight you've been a victor in big moments and you've fallen in big moments what does a moment like this mean here well i mean your opponent has given you everything they had so it's showing respect for your opponent in that handshake line sometimes it's just a look in the eye sometimes it's a pat on the shoulder and sometimes it's nothing but you gotta do it it's part of the game hope everyone had as much fun as we did here tonight for all of us at ea sports i'm james sabalski saying peace